veteran 0121. It's a great full zoom. And uh, tonight we're going to be doing some ESO, of course. And uh, and it's going to be a lot of fun. We're going to check out some more of Craglorn. Maybe, uh, maybe not get killed as much, but we'll see how that goes. But uh, yeah, I'm just getting some shit set up. Sending out the notifications. We're going to be talking Game of Thrones, so I want to let you people know there will be spoilers. Or... There will be some spoilers. I just want to let you know that ahead of time. Keeping myself busy. <laughs> if anybody cares. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> and I make Game Most... of Thrones references on my videos all the time, and nobody seems to get them. Oh, I get them. I just uh, I, you make you make a lot, so it's like uh, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna comment on everything. Well, I know you get them. I'm talking about yeah. everybody else. Yeah, like with like with I am Setsuna, <laughs> Winter is coming. I'm like, this is great. <laughs> this is fucking great. Why isn't anyone saying great title? You know? Yeah. It's just weird. Anyways. There's no cure for being a cunt. <laughs> no, there's no there's no cure for being a cunt. Yeah, Bron, right. Bron, Bron definitely has some of the best lines, for sure. Yeah, man. He always has some of the best lines. I mean, he... He, just in that last season alone, when he was messing with, uh, <clears throat> when he was messing with, uh, what's her, what's his name, Pod, that was some good shit. Uh, YouTube. You know, I gotta admit, I was kind of disappointed uh, when the uh, Prince of Dorne died. Yeah, I was kind of ticked off about that too, because in the book, the, uh, Prince Doran has like this whole other plan, like this other cunning plan. That he's like, I'm going to do this shit. And it's just like, uh, you know, I'm going to be doing this. And it never ends up happening because they kill him. It sucks. It does. But that's all right because I understand. You know what? If they're going to streamline the whole, the, that plot, I'm cool with it. I mean, they only really spent, like, one season on Dorn anyway, so it's not like you're real Like, anybody's really attached to those characters. Yeah. They shouldn't be attached to those characters unless, you know, they were attached to them in the books, I suppose. I was attached to them in the books. Not the ladies, but Duran, I like where he's going. And, uh, yeah. I like where he was going, and I was like, oh, this is going to be good. And then, uh, pretty much... You know, they're like, oh, um, now we're just going to kill them off. But you know what? If you're going to, if you don't have enough time to friggin' show it, I, I understand that too, you know? Yeah. So, you know, so it's all good. As, as a book reader, I am far more understanding of ch subtle of changes that they do in the show versus the book because I'm like, I get it. They don't have, they don't have a thousand pages to go through the whole thing, you know what I mean? So, yep. uh, I totally get it. Yeah, well, there's some people that are like, oh, it's so stupid what they're doing in the show, blah, blah, blah. And it's like, God, you know, just... Yeah, they're like, it's not how it's done in the book. And it's like, yeah, it's not going to be able to because they don't have... They have to They have to keep the action going. They have to keep the pacing going. So, like, uh... Like, instances where it's like, oh, here's this character, and then this other character is right there. Um, they're not appearing, you know, or, like, stuff happens, like, instantaneously, and you're like, what the hell? So, uh, you know, in the book, they go into more detail, but in the show, it's like, we gotta keep it going. It kind of seems like in season six, they were really speeding things along. Yeah, I, I, I have, uh, they were trying to, uh, see, I think they were trying to do that just because they were... They were trying to get, and I think I honestly think that they were trying not to go too far out of the books region. That's why I feel like they're like the whole Tower of Joy scene. They kind of did it in a way where they told you who it was, but they didn't tell you who it was just because they're like. I think that they have a lot of respect for George R. R. Martin, and they want to let him, him, you know, un unveil John's uh, parentage. But everybody knows. Who John's parents are? I mean, I mean come everybody's on now. known for a long time, anyways. The yeah. only pe the only people that didn't know are people that aren't like hardcore like viewers of the show. 
People yeah. that just kind of casually watch but don't really, like, you know, put that much stock in it or don't think about it too much. Exactly. Exactly. So let's get this party started. All right. So Only True Gamers is a gaming group that I am involved in. We are based out of Connecticut, but we have members worldwide. And now, finally, I can unveil that we actually have our own website. So if you go to OnlyTrueGamers.net, you can go there and check out our website where you can go to where you can go and check out the Facebook page right there. You can read articles by our buddies that are doing video game related articles. We're going to we have uh, the stream up there. If you want to watch when we stream, you can go right to Only True Gamers. There's a lot of really cool stuff over there. And then if you want to join the Facebook page, it's on facebook.com backslash groups backslash Only True Gamers. So go there and do that and join up and uh, be part of the phenomenon that is only true gamers. All right, fellas, let us get going. All right, so we are in Craglorn, and last time we were playing, we were what the hell were we doing? We were fighting a losing battle against some against, bosses, against some dickhole in, 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 <laughs> a, in a dungeon. No, a bunch of dickholes, like some big ass troll, and then some dickholes. Yeah, so yes, yeah, so all those trolls. Oh, look at this, Dan sent me money. You know, I was watching oh. that footage, and you know what I think a lot of our problem was? Those fucking oh. archer, those archers, man. Yeah. I think I, what I need to do is I need to prioritize killing them fuckers while you guys keep the big guys busy, and then, you know, we'll go from there. I, I, I yeah. think that's what our problem was, man. Like we. Yeah, were... I noticed that the archers <coughs> kick our asses too, man. They, they like, uh... They, like, beat the F out of us. Because it, that, they're usually the guys who keep hitting us while we're trying to deal with the big dudes, and then and then we don't get a chance to deal with the big dudes because we always got these archers hitting us all over the place. Yeah. Well, I'm, you know? thinking, I'm thinking, yeah, I think when we roll into that fucking room again, that last room we were in, I'm going to just prioritize killing all the, all the small fuckers, like all the archers and shit, before doing yeah. anything else. Yeah. That seems like a sound plan, Paul. I had a question for you, Paul. What's up? Would you like some frost, Miriam? Sure. I have six. I'll take any that you have. I can always use them for food. I can always use them for fucking ambrosia, psychic ambrosia, whatever. Hmm. So yeah, season six of Game of Thrones was really good, and. Uh, some stuff in the beginning, like the whole, like what we were talking about was with Dorne. That was kind of odd where it's like, oh, they're killing off Dorian's, or no, they're killing off uh, Oberian's family so that they can take charge. And it's like, and and it was, that was weird. But they, that ended up being good because at the end of the whole thing, they're like, you know, the, the two groups joined each other. And I can't wait for Cersei to get her ass handed to her. Oh, that's going to be kind of nice. Yeah, because if you think about it, does she really oh, have any? A does she really have any allies at this point? Yeah, let me let me add you guys into the uh, thing. Uh, yeah, she really doesn't have any allies. No, she's pretty much hated. Yeah, and the thing about it too is like, it's like I love the look that Jamie gave her at the end of the season, where he's, like he comes back and he's like, he's looking at, at the fucking city on fire. And he's like, uh, and he, and look at this, Dan's trying to call. I gotta, I gotta cancel the call, Dan. Um, let me add Dan into this. Uh, but, uh, yeah, so the look that he gave her was pretty, like, what the hell did you do? Because if you think about it, he actually, uh, he actually, um, he saved the city from that shit happening by killing Ares. And then he's like, what the fuck did my sister do kind of thing? You know what I mean? Well, yeah, at first, I mean, I think he thought that, like, you know, there was more destruction than just that fucking sept. Yeah, and then he then he comes in and he sees Cersei pretty much just crowns herself fucking queen. What the hell is the blacksmithing? Upstairs. Yeah. Or wrong, wrong house, actually. Yeah, it's over here. It's over here. But yeah, yeah. Hello, Dan, what's happening? 
Not a whole lot. And a few. Ah, you know, pretty much same old, same old. I was let me. I'll tell you about some shit that was going on today with fucking my. I was trying to capture some footage today because I was. I'm trying to do this video for the only true gamers about I am Setsuna doing my first impressions of the game. Uh huh. Just kind of like doing that, and the fucking thing, my capture card wasn't working. But we were able to. Uh, <laughs> we were able to. Uh, what is it? Analyze it down to it's the this USB extension thing that I'm using. Uh -huh. That thing was causing it to fuck up, which was also causing my computer to make all kinds of noise too. So I'm glad that we we figured that shit out. But it's still a fucking pain in the ass. So I didn't get a chance to do that, but I I do want to do a first impressions of the game, which I did play, Paul. And it is very good so far. Yeah, I, I fucking love it. I love the game. Yeah. I made it up to the uh, boat area, like right after the shipwreck. I oh, made okay. it right in the very beginning of the game, so I'm not that far. I only played it for maybe like an hour and a half, so. Okay. But yeah, it's really good. It reminds me a lot of, uh, I think you were mentioning it in your video, uh, Final Fantasy X. Yeah, it's like, a, it's like a fucking Final Fantasy X with like Chrono Trigger mechanics. Mm-hmm. Kind of. Yeah, there's a character later on that is kind of like, uh, like Oren too, mm -hmm. and he, he basically a tank like Oren, and I'm, you know, I'm like, you know, a sucker for those kind of abilities. Like I try to use them a lot. Yeah. Like, you know, I, I would have loved if a character in Chrono Trigger had had shit like that. Yeah, like Robo or something. Yeah, or anybody really. Yeah. I think the closest thing you have to that in Chrono Trigger is Nadia's provoke ability, and when the fuck are you ever going to use that ability with her in that game? Right, right, right. All right, so I did all my business, so now let's go to the Way Shrine. Where are we heading to today, fellas? What do you think? I think we should so head we back to that fucking dungeon we were in. All right. Oh, 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 I remember what I have to do. What? I gotta fix my shit. Oh yeah, you know. Oh shit, you know what I forgot to do? I forgot to buy more repair kits. Shit, man. I gotta fix my gear. But yeah, so I am Setsuna. I would, uh, if you like, if you like uh, Chrono Trigger and sh old school RPGs, I'll tell you this right now. They're, they're very good. Oh no, damaged items. I must have repaired it before. No, I'm talking to this guy. Repair. It says no damaged items, but then my oh vampire. How do you re-enchant your weapon again? You just uh, char you, ch you don't re-enchant it. You charge it. Oh, more more action. Enchant or oh here we go charge. And then I can use these soul gems. Can I use like the shitty ones or should I use the greater ones? What do you think? Uh. Well, use whatever you think you need. I, I don't know. Use whichever right. ones you want. I would try to use the shittier ones first before using the the grand ones, because grand ones, uh, you need to revive yourself. <coughs> yeah, that's what I was thinking, too. Okay. Oh, no. Fuck. Well, I, I didn't get repair kits, so I don't know. Yeah, mainly because I can't remember where the hell I can buy them. So, hopefully we have enough. Hopefully we won't right. need too many of them. Alright. Yeah, I'm good. Anyways, uh... Yeah, so... Game of Thrones, great show. I am Satsuna, great game. What else? Um... Oh yeah, that cave is over here. Right, right, right. Valley of the Scars. But, uh... What else was I gonna say? Oh yeah, so yeah, I had trouble with that, and I was trying to get that shit going. It was pain in the ass. Pretty much, I'm just gonna get a new wire. Not a not an extension, but like a one wire that'll put into the capture card and the uh, go right to the computer, so that I won't have any troubles. Ah oh, shit. Are we all with us? Why am I running around waiting, not waiting for everybody? James, uh, are you uh? Who am I? I'm just waiting for James, right? Yep. Oh, look, this guy's getting attacked. I will be with you momentarily. 
that. I just, uh, I just saved the day. I'm a hero. Those well uh, are creepy. Hmm. And, uh, yeah, man, so, uh, it's gonna be good shit. Good shit when Game of Thrones comes back. And I, I was thinking about this just a little bit ago. I think this show, The Night Of, that I'm watching, is this new HBO like show. Uh, I honestly think, I think it's better if you, not that I'm not saying that you shouldn't watch it because it's a terrific show. I just think it'd be better to wait and fucking binge watch it because it kind of leaves you wanting more at the end of it. And it's like, oh god, I gotta wait till next week. What the fuck, you know? Yeah. Okay. But it is very good. It's goddamn good. I keep talking about how I feel like it's like... The, I keep talking about how I feel like it's the, uh, the... Like, like this is really how... Like, cops talk to each other and shit like that kind of thing. Hello, kitty. Like, the way that they're talking to each other and talking to the prisoners, this, that, and the other. It's really goddamn good. There are a lot of people around here today, huh? Damn. So, oh, we're going to be defeat Bullzog, the Butcher. Where are we going again? Yeah, we're heading north. Uh, yeah. Oh, wait, here's the cave. This is the cave. That's where we're supposed to be going. Sorry, Paul. I was looking at the big circle thinking that's where we're supposed to be going, but no. We gotta go this way. You're right, Paul. All Through right, here. let me just teleport to you. But yeah, good times. I don't remember oh, coming. you know what? I, I do have a prediction about Mr. Uh, Bran. You're nice. Yeah. I think yeah. he is going to... I think he is going to uh, go back into the past and prevent the White Walkers from being made. That might be something. I can see that happening. Because we've, uh, we've already seen that he can affect the past because look at Hodor. Right, right, right. But no, see... the. I think that's the thing. He, the reason why Hodor became Hodor was because Bran fucked with him. It's like a weird time travel thing. I, even I can't really explain it what's, that well. Uh, yeah. What's the uh, the phrase that we used? Uh, the past is written, the ink is dry. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. I so I don't, I don't. I don't think he's gonna be able to go back and stop the White Walkers. I think he'll be able to at least find out what the hell's going on with them, and maybe find. Like, here's what I honestly think is gonna happen. Is he's gonna head back to the wall, and what's gonna happen is because he has the knight's king. Ah, no, let's not bother these guys. But he has the knight's king mark on him that he's pretty much gonna bring down the wall, and he's gonna because he's desperately gonna go and try and find his John and tell him, you know, hey, you're a fucking Targaryen Stark kid, right? And uh, he's desperately gonna go and try and do that, and uh, he's gonna bring down the wall. And by that time, I think Daenerys, what's going to happen is Daenerys is going to pretty much, she's going to come and wreck havoc with the Tyrells and the Martells and just fucking take down Cersei. Like, hands down, I honestly don't think Cersei's going to last next season. I want, I'm going to say she's going to be dead next season. Where the hell's the, the guy? Oh, there's a guy behind you, Dan. But yeah, I, I honestly don't think Cersei's going to last the season. And I think after that point, Daenerys is going to go... She's pretty much going to have pretty much the Riverlands and all that shit taken... Why are these guys attacking these people here? I don't understand. But while the, while she's, she's taking care of, like, the South with Dorne and the Martells and all that shit and, and all that good stuff, I think what's going to happen is she's going to take over, then she's going to head to the north, and John's going to be like, yo, there's this problem that we have to deal with. And then she's going to be like, okay, let's fucking get rid of these White Walkers. And I think that's what's going to end up happening. That, that is, like, I don't think John and Daenerys are going to fight each other. It's going to happen sort of like history where the Starks, you know, when Rhaegar, the, or not Rhaegar, uh, Rhaegar? The Conqueror? No, Aegon the Aegon Conqueror. Aegon the Conqueror, yep. Right. When Aegon the Conqueror came to take over the North, the, those guys just knelt. Because the dragon did so much damage, or they knew that they couldn't beat a dragon, they, they just pretty much knelt. 
they bent the knee and they're like, yeah, all right, we'll fucking work with you. I think it's going to happen similar that way where there'll be no bloodshed. And John will be like, John will be like, you can have the North back or you can leave us alone and the North won't bother you if you help us get rid of these White Walkers because this is a, this is a kingdom thing. And if you can't save the kingdom from the White Walkers, you can't, you don't deserve a kingdom kind of thing. That's what I think is going to happen. Probably, yeah. Yeah. I, I definitely, I'm definitely with you. I don't think there's going to be any bloodshed between John and uh, Daenerys. Yeah. At least. I, th I think there may even be a possibility of them two getting married. Yeah, that might happen. That might happen. I mean, Targaryens have uh, hooked up with each other and before, uh, so that could happen for sure. And it wouldn't even be really incest because John is mixed blood anyways, so yeah. it's not even... I mean, yeah, sure, they're related, but only half yeah. related. Yeah, sort of half cousins or some shit like that. Oh, well, actually, John's like, uh, <laughs> John's fucking Daenerys' nephew. Mm-hmm. It'd be aunt, oh, yeah, aunt, yeah, aunt yeah. and nephew marrying, actually. Right, right, right. It'd be weird. It, let's just put it that way. It'd be goddamn weird. But they're probably around the same age anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Yeah. I mean, Rhaegar was their very, very older brother. That's true. But yeah, so that's what I think is going to happen. And then the entire... I think that that's going to happen within a whole season. And I think I think that they'll probably get rid of uh, Euron Greyjoy. I bet you he'll die uh, next season, maybe. And then season seven is just going to be like everybody versus the White Walkers. Kind of shit, you know what I mean? I could see that happening. Yeah. What if the White Hey, Walk Abel, what's happening? Thanks for joining us. I hope you don't mind these Game of Thrones spoiler talks, but that's what we're going to be yapping about. Because our buddy James here, he uh, just finished uh, <clears throat> Game of Thrones watching, caught up. So it's all good. Season 6 was on fire. Yeah, man. Season 6 was the most exciting to me because it was like all out, all, like as a book reader, like... I knew a lot of the stuff that was going to happen season one through five, but like season six was great because I don't know what was going to happen. And that was kind of exciting, but like in a good way. Like the first season, I didn't read the books and everything that I didn't know was going to happen was like, like when Ned Stark was like, oh my God, what the fuck? Why isn't someone helping him and, and this, that, and the other? And then I'm like, I can't believe they killed the main character kind of shit. So like after that, I didn't want to be surprised like that. but. At this point in the game, I'm all right with being sort of surprised like that, because at the you know reading all the books, nothing really surprises me. You know what I mean? Oh, there's people behind us, fucking archers. But yeah, man. One thing I did do, I don't know if I mentioned this on stream, but I pre-ordered like. A bunch of Dragon Quest games. I know, Abel, you'll be pretty pumped by that. I pre-ordered uh, Dragon Quest Seven, and Dragon Quest Builders. Where are we going? North. And I pre-ordered... Uh, uh, what the hell is the name of that game? No Man's Sky. Which looks pretty amazing. Is anybody yeah. else getting sick of those bitches following us around? Well, th th they're part of the quest. That's the only reason why. I know, but I'm still sick of her. Yeah, they're always screaming, I need aid! Yeah. I need aid! I need aids! Alright, alright, alright. We should fo- Oh, shit, I died. But we should probably focus on the, uh, the- On the, the archers, dudes. the archers, yeah. The yeah, the wizard, wizard guys over there. I can't help bound anybody because I'm dead. But yeah, take out those wizard fuckers. Ah, shit. Yeah, those guys are fire dudes. They're pain in the ass. Uh-oh. It's gonna hit me with something here. Yeah, they're uh. just trying to get that 
fucking shaman shooting fire. So yeah, I think we need to we need to hit those guys a little bit because they they just keep hurling projectiles at us. We all died. Yeah. Fuck. Oh shit! You know what? Before we take on anybody, let's back the fuck up. I didn't. I eat need anything. to eat. Oh yeah, damn! Yeah, we didn't eat a goddamn. Good call, man. I completely forgot about that shit. Let's see, consumable. Yeah, we'll go ahead and eat some of these. <clears throat> I'm gonna shit, man. I need to repair my gear. All right, well, I'm gonna wait and not fucking fuck around with these guys. All right, everything's. So I thought I repaired my shit. Like uh, at the end, like before, like when we were done last week, I thought I repaired all my shit, man. I can't, I'm like down on like the 20 and 30 percent now with this shit. I'm in the 80s and 90s still. Damn, man. I'm still doing pretty all right. Okay. But uh. Where you go now? All right, cool. I'm gonna wait though. Everybody ready? I'm ready. Ready. Dan. Yep. All right, let's go. Oh boy. Here we go. Where are you, James? Right here. Dude. Keeping this big fucking bastard busy. How the why hell? aren't any of these why aren't any of these bitches helping, man? Shit. Why are we having so much trouble with these guys? Yeah. Oh, that orc's almost dead. Oh shit, I died. I was about to heal. God damn it. Okay, okay. It won't let me hit. It won't let me uh, come back yet. There you go, guys. Take him out. No, oh, no, I died. That's all right. Dan is alive. Man, those guys are dicks. Come on, can I come back? Please, well, yeah. come on, game. Yeah, oh, you got rid of one of them. Good. They won't let me drink my freaking. Oh no, they're both there. Well, I'm dead. Shit. And I can't come back. Apparently, they I keep throwing fire at me. I can't fucking. They're just pelting me with fire, and there's nothing I can do. Oh, uh, they fucking assholes, man. Oh, five year, five days ago was the one year anniversary of me streaming ESO. That's pretty interesting to know, Weeble. Thank you. Five years ago? Nothing. Or five days ago. Five days ago. Oh. Yeah, I can't help you guys out. Apparently, I don't have any, uh, 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 whatever, soul gems or whatever, so. You don't? If you. No, it says here, revive here and filled, and I don't have any filled, apparently. Once you're done killing these guys. Good, good, good. good. One's down? Jeez. Yeah. Where are you at, Pete? I can't. Take these I'm, guys. uh, I'm right near this mage guy. Christ. Yeah, just take him out, though. Yeah, man. If these, if they we're having this much trouble, jeez, man. Jeez. Yeah, I can't believe I've been streaming for a whole year. That's crazy. Eventually, I will will be streaming some different games. I mean. I want. I want to try some other different uh, other games to do on Sundays. Get back here, you little cocksucker! Got him. Nice. I got experience for that. Where are you at? Okay. Damn, man. Yeah, I want. How many soul gems do I have? Seventy-nine. 
Well, I can spare a few if you need some. I he, have... He needs some. Yeah. Oh, I have 38. Inventory. You got less than me. Yeah. Supplies. Grand soul gems. I have none. Oh, I have 33, but they're empty. 53, but they're empty. How do I fill them? By killing stuff, remember? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Apparently, I haven't been killing anything. Uh, you gotta... The idea is to stock them up. Right. Do you have that passive ability? Uh, I think so. Let me see. Skills, soul magic... Passive abilities. Yeah, I have them. I don't have to equip them. I just sent you five, Pete. Thank you. Alright, I'm gonna send you a few, too. Uh, I'll try not to die five times. I'm gonna keep an eye on the healing thing. Yeah, I but mean, yeah. I don't remember us having problems with, with those guys last time. Neither do I, man. That's why it's really weird. What does this guy have? Nothing good. And yeah, these friggin' ladies, at least last time they were helping. It didn't seem like they were doing shit this time. They were just sitting back. They were being a bunch of shitholes. Okay. There you go. Now you got a few more. Cool, thank you, James. <coughs> and I'll check it. Let's open this door. Go in the door, damn it. There we go. Alright, we're pretty close to that section. Oh, good. I have my ultimate if I need it. Foul beast. Mm hmm. <laughs> I need assistance. Shut up. Yeah, I'm getting sick of that too. I know. I'm why don't they fucking heal? Yeah, they don't really heal us. I wish they would. They're only friggin' helping themselves. They're a bunch of jerk offs. All right. Ah, uh, yeah, is this, is this where we were? Is this where we got our yes. asses kicked? Yes, it is. Yeah, and now we can go in here, and then we can hit... We can stay right here. <coughs> what do we plan on doing, fellas? Not dying. Yep. Yeah, all right, that's good. Hold on, I don't know. No, okay. All right, so we have a bunch of these Jagoffs. I know we got a bunch of archers back there, so I'll try to take them out if I can. Yeah, so I'm gonna hit... Here's what I'm gonna do. These guys on the uh, left here, I'm gonna throw a thing. Now they're gonna come after us. Or at least this guy's coming after us. Oh, fuck. Let's just try to get one dude at a time here. If they're not coming after us, good. Alright, okay, here comes the big guy. Here comes the big guy. Now, the thing about this big guy is... He, uh... The thing about the big guy is... Once he gets down a certain percentile... Where are you, James? Here we go, healing. Once he gets down to so much God. HP... He will, uh, he'll start... Fuck. Why is, it, why is this game gotta be so fucking hard? Oh, I healed. Come on, I was hitting that button. And I feel like, uh... Dead. Oh, sh We're all dead. Do you guys have any ultimates? I yeah. Do. I, I can use two at the moment. Two? I can only use one. Two. Yep. 
I, I can, yeah, I can, my ultimate, I can, I can drop it down twice. Oh, okay. That must be nice. I wish I could do that with mine. You're talking- Yeah, my ultimate, my ultimate's the healing thing that I was using. Okay. We got a lot of fuckers here. Oh shit. Oh shit. I better. I don't know how the hell we're gonna do this. Because the thing is, it's not like you can take them out in waves. Like, once you defeat one of these big troll guys, then the big fucking guy comes, and then after he after he loses like a third of his health, the fucking other guy comes from back there. But then you have, let's see, one, two, three, there's like six other dudes in the way back there. Well, I could drop an ultimate on the big dude. Hmm. And try and stay where, alive until the other. I see dude what Dan's comes. doing. I see what Dan's doing. Dan, you tell us when you're going, and then I'm gonna throw this thing. So well, then we is can. Is there a wet place I should be? Like I'm. Not I don't know. Try. You're you're looking around. I figured you're gonna try and hit him from behind or something. Um. I mean, should I try and go from behind and go for these uh, these archer guys too? I mean, I could do that. Yeah, I guess if you want to go that way, sure. And then I'm gonna stay in the middle here. I don't know. I don't know how credible this is gonna be. I mean, I'm I, gonna at, stick with from you. the get go, I'm gonna like, uh, yeah. I, I, I'll start working on these fucking archer guys in back here. Yeah. All right, James. You see this guy in the in the upper? I'm gonna go for this guy right here in the upper left or the upper right area right here. The troll who's getting healed by the this guy in the on the right side. Okay, like, so if you're over looking, here. If you're, yeah, yes, yes. So tell me when you guys are going, and then I'm going to go too. So do you want me to go? After okay, do you want me to go with you, or should I go after the other troll? Uh, no, go with me because I think that troll is going to come after us. And then James and Paul, I mean Paul and Dan, can hit their guys, and hopefully we'll we'll quell this a little bit. I'm going after From, the archers. Yeah. Okay. All right. So are we ready? I guess I'll throw the first throw. Ready? Everybody ready? Yep. Here we go. Alright, alright. Alright, apparently, here we go. Let's get rid of these sons of bitches. I'm gonna heal us up a little bit. James, I'll try to keep us healed while we're going here. Alright, we got rid of those guys. Okay, we got a little chaos going. I like what's happening. They don't know who to go for. Very good. Very good. Here we go. Now we're there. We go. Let's get this troll guy over here. Let's get this troll guy over here, James. All right, we're doing great, guys. Except now we got both bosses on us. We got both bosses on us. It's all right. I have an idea. Oh shit! Get out of the ice. I have an idea, guys. What's this that? Uh, he can't Back get here, by little... the stairs over here. I'll keep him distracted because we're fighting the big guy, the other big guy. Yeah, you gotta take him out first. Where oh, are you, James? Oh, now he's coming for me. Ah, run away, run away, run away, get away from me, fucker. Ah. All right, I'm still distracting this troll. Good. Keep that. Wait, we got we got this guy down like a quarter. Yeah, come after me, you piece of shit. Get out of the ice. Oh, Owie. Shit. All right, hold him while I'm doing my ultimate. Here we go. We're healing. This isn't going to work, but I can try. Oh, look at that. It did freeze him for a second. Man, why does he keep coming after me? Fucking guy keeps chasing me. All right, get out of the ice. Stay away from me, dude. We got him. All right, now let's go get that troll bastard. How you doing over there, Dan? Oh, I have got him pinned down to this little corner here. He can't get me. Okay. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna use it. Yeah, yeah, Paul, go go with your uh, stay with your bow and arrow. Where the hell is he going? He's chasing oh, me. Get it. Bat oh, he's chasing you. Yeah. Here, come over here. Come over here. Come over here. Me. Go back to the stairs. Okay. Yeah. All right, I'm helping out James here. We're taking this piece of shit. Oh, he didn't follow you. No, he's just chilling at the door over here. 
Me and James are hitting him in the front. You guys keep bowing, bowing him. Blow him, blow him. <laughs> oh. All right, we're doing pretty good here. We almost got him. And then his big bad boss guy can't come after us either. I'm yeah. All right, eat that, eat that. Yeah. Per nice strategy, fellas. Nice thinking, Dan. Nice thinking. Yeah, that, that fucking uh, pincer attack idea was definitely good. Yeah, because that that fucking that was that was like really fucking good. I have to pat her. Yeah, I, I went I went in there. I took care of the fucking archers and I booked ass out of there and I fucking just started just I don't know. Ma mainly, I was just trying to keep away from the big guys because they fucking murder my ass if I get too close. Yeah. All right. Everything worked pretty good. Nice job, James. Too. Hell of a shit show. Yes. I love it. I love that we beat those guys. Does it make you feel good when you get your ass handed to my boss last week, and then we figure out how to beat him this week? Yeah. It fucking makes me feel great, man. It sure does. Now we just gotta go talk to this broad outside, and we'll be done with this quest. But yeah, maybe we should think about doing that a little bit more when the, when when we notice there's a lot of a lot of guys. Because if you take it, yeah, because you notice how. It, like we were like some weird wall, and then it just and it was just waves of guys kept hitting us, and our wall pretty much just crumbled. You know what I mean? Yeah. So Dan, how, how did you keep that guy from fucking hurting you over in the corner there? Because there was this there was a staircase, and then there was this pillar right at the corner of, of the staircase, and he couldn't fit. He he had to walk around the pillar to get at me, but I could jump in between the staircase and the pillar. So every time he'd walk around the pillar. To, to come get me, I jumped through the little, the tiny little gap again, and you have to walk all the way around again. Nice. And so I just kept, I just kept doing that over again and over again. I was shooting arrows at him the whole time. Nice. And then whenever he was running at you guys, I just shoot him in the butt with arrows until he'd come back at me. Oh, good. Yeah, well, we got rid of them. Yeah, that was, that was masterful, man. Because you ke you kept that asshole busy, and then you know the, the the rest of us were able to take out that that other guy. Yeah, because that other guy was a real pain in the ass. Yeah, he's using. Because I remember he. He's using freaking uppercut on us and shit. Yeah, I remember him coming after us last week, where like we didn't even we had like three quarters of the the bo big boss the big pole, <laughs> his HP down. Then he came out of nowhere and he wrecked our ass. All right, little leaf is out here. Let's talk to this bitch. All right, we got a single weapon enhancement, enchantment. Oh, please. Oh, no. So that's how he did it. Don't tell me we just started another one. Oh, God. We just started another one. Really? Yeah, holding court. Talk to Regent Caspia in Dragonstar. Eh, I'm not doing that right now. Let's go find this butcher guy. Golzag the Butcher. He's around here. Yeah, it's just a point. Once you guys are finished talking to this lady. I'm done. Is everybody done? Everyone done? I'm done. Yep. Alright, let's go talk. Uh, let's go find the butcher and make him die. I I am okay with that. Yeah. Wait, I hear. So, James, what did you think of them leaving Dario behind? Oh. Where is everybody? Up here on the hillside. Yeah. I think I honestly think Dario is probably the uh, l most logical guy to leave behind. You know what I mean? Like for uh, Game of Thrones Fuck. with. The... What's going on, Paul? My skills are fucked up. Oh. That's why I died. I mean, I, I'm not. I don't. I'm not one to make excuses a lot, but my skills are genuinely fucked up right now. So if you guys could just hold up for a second, it'll, it'll only take me a few seconds to fix it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All, All right, right no. let's stay put for a minute. Thank you, James. I got those uh, soul gems. Nice. Mm, I'm gonna wait until I got more champion points. Okay. But uh, yeah, I honestly think that uh, I think that was a good move. Cause out of everybody, it's like. Okay, good to yeah, go. Out of everybody, it seemed like he had like he had the least amount to like give to the story, you know what I mean, after the whole thing. Although I thought he would be like the new head Dothraki guy for a bit and be like, he'd be able to keep him in line. 
But Oh yeah, him, yeah. Yeah, Dario. She pretty much is like, yo, I can't bring you. You're gonna stay here and watch Marine. Yeah, I think that was pretty smart on her part. Yeah. Because I mean he knows the land, you know, he knows the, the way things are. Yeah. I I must say I, I was uh, quite pleased to find uh Tyrion become hand of the queen. Yeah, that was cool. I like that too. Dude, why my skills are still fucked. What the hell, man? Why are my skills still fucked up? They shouldn't still be fucked up. Yeah, I'm using this add-on that lets me switch to a staff, but I don't know, man. I think it's glitchy. I might have to disable it. Okay, I can use Rally. Good. That's what I need. Jesus Christ. All right, let's go. Sorry, fellas. All right. No, it's all right. We're, We're going to the fun. butcher. We're going to go pick up a pound of... Uh, uh, I'm thinking well, chop... Yeah, we're gonna go pick up a pound of. I'm gonna get a pound of cheese. Gotta get me a pound of veal, or no, like some of that good ham. What's the three ninety nine per pound? I need that. Boar's head. Boar's head. Okay, I'll pick up some boar's head. You gonna get some of that turkey wrapped in bacon? That stuff's good. Yum. What else are we gonna need? Uh, American cheese. Gotta have some of that, right? Um. I like cheddar. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You know what my that, favorite is? Colby Jack. Yeah, that's pretty good. Yeah, that's good shit, too, man. This fucking guy. I'll take a pound of Colby. I'll take a pound of cheddar with the butcher. Um, I don't know. Any of you guys want any Italian stuff? I'll get, I'll, get a, I'll get a quarter pound of mortadella. All right. Um, let's go over here. I think he's... I like provolone. Some, there we go, provolone. Got it. <laughs> you got it. Doing? I'm talking like, about we're, we're taking an order to to kill the butcher. Oh, we're, we're like fighting all these guys, and you're making a shopping list. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. All right, all right. Let's look at our situation here. There's two giant trolls. The guys over there cutting up our salami for us. Uh, there's a troll over there. It looks like he might be coming down to join the party. And uh, that's it. Three dudes, but I have a feeling those are going to be a lot more. I really do. And let's see if this troll is going to go back. Is he going to turn his stupid ass around? I don't know. Do you want us? I say do you want us to do, like kind of? Do you want me and Dan to kind of sneak around to like different like? Areas, so yeah. We can kinda, here we go. Here, I got a good so idea. So we can pincer attack and, them again. Yeah, you and Dan go behind back there. Okay. You see where I'm, and uh, yeah, and then you hit these trolls from behind, and then me and James will come, come this way, and we'll get them. Who are we and going then, after? Uh, we're gonna go after this troll right in front of us here. All right. And as soon as you, you, as soon as you guys get around, uh, Paul, watch out for the troll behind you. You want me to he's, go further? He's coming. He's coming. He's coming, Paul. Yeah, okay, there you go. You got it. All right, you guys... Yeah, that's perfect. You guys ready? Yeah. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to throw the first punch. Here we go. Here we go. I don't know if the butcher's coming down. Oh, the butcher's coming down, James. Watch out for the butcher. He's ready to give us a pound of salami. Oh, and his hard provolone. All right, you guys almost got that troll? Yep. Almost. We're taking out the butcher. Dead. All right, let's get our let's get our friggin' uh, He's running from me. He's chasing me for fucking, some reason. Let's get our mort mortadella. Let's go. I want that pound of bologna right now, Mister Butcher. <laughs> Give me the good ham. Where the hell is he going? He looks like Darth Maul. He's chasing me. Ball. He's got this fucking red black face. Oh! Fucking piece of shit likes chasing me for some reason. Oh yeah, we got him. We got this guy. He's dead. 
Yeah, we beat the butcher. Looks like his store is down mine. Search for personal effects. Huh? You must have something. Oh, right here on this hill. Oh. Oh. Look at this. We got to dig through the dirt. Gross. All right, return the scattered leaves. Who the hell is that? Is she down here? Okay, she's down here. Dude, I got to I got to disable this fucking add-on, man. Yeah. This um add-on is cancer. Literally. Yeah, Abel, uh I am playing I am Setsuna. Uh I played it. I probably played an hour and a half of it and I really like it so far. I've played uh, I've played through most of the game. It's pretty fucking awesome. Yeah. Yeah, so uh, it's probably worth the forty. Is that how much it was? Forty yep. bucks? Yep, it was forty. It, it's it's probably well worth it, especially if you like those old school RPGs. Chrono, it plays like Chrono Trigger, and it's got a story similar to uh, similar to uh, Final, Fantasy <clears throat> Final Fantasy X, and a little bit of uh, a little bit of Tales of Symphonia. Yeah, a little bit. I, well, I wouldn't say the story. Why do you, why do you say it's like Tales of Symphonia? Well, I just think of Colette when she's using ch shock around. Oh, yeah, you know yeah, saying? yeah. Okay, yeah, there you go. That kind of makes sense. Yeah, and she's the chosen, and then everyone's protecting her and all that shit, you know. Yeah. So that, But then again, I think Tales of Symphonia came out after Final Fantasy X, so th they might have uh, had similar stories. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Hey, Pete, hold on, man. I'm disabling this fucking add-on. All right, no problem. These bugs ain't gonna fuck with us. But yeah, I am Setsuna. It's got terrific music too. Like I was listening to uh, the town of uh, what the hell, Nive. I think that's the name of the, fir the first town you go to. Mm -hmm. I'll listen. To I'll listen to that tune all day. And like you were saying, everything's on the piano, so it sounds really, really good. It just, it's just a really great game. The art style is pretty cool. I kind of wish that they had the. Uh, like portraits, a little bit more like bigger portraits that you can look at, but I'm cool with what they, what we got so far. Paul, you're mo through most of the game. How many characters are there? Like the number, like seven or seven. something. Seven, just like Chrono okay. Trigger. Cool. All right, where where are you guys? Okay, there you go. We're right behind, right behind you. Okay, yeah, I'm good to go now. Yep. I disabled that fucking add-on and fixed my shit. Cool. But yeah, I am. Do flash for a tooth break over there? Uh, no. Where? Right here by this tree. Oh God, is he gonna make us do something? First, Probably. Bloody, then the little goats come. Outsiders the burn the court. Sure, we'll burn the court. Uh, yeah, I don't even care. That was what I was doing. Oh right, right, right. Well, I want to go and finish off that one thing first. I guess we'll have to go back over there and burn all that crap, but let's uh go back and tell them that we killed the butcher or whatever. All right, there's some dudes here. Hello, dudes. See, these archers are just as annoying as Dan is as an archer. They keep, <laughs> they keep hitting you from behind and stuff, and you're like, son of a bitch. And you go away. I guess I'll take that as a compliment. Yeah, me, yeah. me too, man. <laughs> <laughs> He's not the... Yeah, because you're annoying. You're annoying, and you keep hitting me with fucking damage. Can't stand it. All right, we finished yeah, this. Just we finished the butcher. Oh shit! Yeah, I got a lot of experience. All right, I guess we gotta go back and burn those those uh, flags, guys. Let's burn them. <laughs> burn. Burning the flag. And so we get to fight through all those hordes of bad guys again. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm... not nearly as many though. Well, well, we don't have to fight any boss dudes, and that's pretty cool. Oh yeah, we just gotta fight through the random mob guys. Yeah, like these guys. Oh look, the wasp came. But yeah, Abel, I finished off Dragon Quest Monsters, Joker, whatever, and uh, tomorrow will be the last episode, and then I'm gonna work on. Uh, I'm working on some uh, Lufia two. And, uh, what else?
Dragon Quest V, I'm going to be doing that. I like Lufia 2 a little bit more than I do the first one. Yeah, me too. It, it, they just took everything that was really fun about the first one, and they fixed... They, like, made it, them walk faster. The graphics are really nice. The music is really great. Really great. And it's just an overall fucking really good game, man. Alright, where am I going? We gotta head north. Yeah, I enjoyed this your, uh, your Lufia LP. That yeah, this one cool. should be a lot of fun. Thank you, by the way. You're welcome. Nerd root. Yeah, this one should be a lot of fun. Oh, I gotta catch root. up on... I gotta pretty much catch up on your, your stuff uh, tomorrow when I go back to work. I'll wait up here. Oh, you guys are still... Okay, good. Yeah, Lufia is one of those games that, for whatever reason, I just never played back in the 90s. Yeah, man, I didn't even know about Lufia until I saw, it, like, Funko Land or whatever. And I saw, like, the clouds moving on the... In the like, apparently it doesn't take a lot to, like, impress me. <laughs> like, the clouds are moving... The clouds are moving on the overworld. I'm like, this is awesome! That's... Wow! I, I, I have a similar uh, reaction to, like, Castlevania 4. I'm like, holy shit, the background actually, like, looks realistic yeah. when you move and shit. You know, because the backgrounds were always, like, you know, the same static backgrounds. Like, when you mm -hmm. go on, like, like, a side scroller or, like, a platformer. And now, in, mm -hmm. like, Castlevania 4, I remember that being, like, the first game. I was like, wow, you mean, like, the backgrounds actually look real and shit? Yeah. Like... Yeah, Super Castlevania 4, man. I love that game. One of my favorite games yeah. ever. Yeah. And then the fucking soundtrack in that game. Oh, amazing. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah, man. Fucking, the, I have... Uh, I of down Simon. Yeah, dude. I downloaded that that soundtrack because I was like, this is just too good. All right, where the hell... Is, all right, we got to go north and take out another one. Exarch Stronghold, was that the place where we killed that giant troll? Yeah. For some reason, it doesn't mark on my map as being completed. Yeah, you weren't. For some reason, you didn't end up doing that quest unless you uh, did it in the off time. Part of that in the off time. Remember, we were gonna we were, we were gonna go back and help you if you had to do that shit again. Who did you talk to to get that quest? Oh, I don't even remember. Some random orc guy. Yeah, and then this girl followed us, and, and she's like, "Oh, we gotta do this. We gotta do that. We gotta do this." Hey, what the fuck, man? Oh shit! I died. That sucks. Fucking more of these archer assholes. But yeah, man, Super Castlevania was the shit. I'll still go back and play that game. That's how good that fucking game yeah, is. That game, as far as as far as Castlevania games, yeah, that's about as perfect as I want a Castlevania game to be. Yeah, because you know what, too, it's like I haven't seen them do that whole fucking let your whip hang low and shit like that. All that good shit that they just are like, yeah, next game we're not gonna bother. Multi-angled whips, whips uh, smacking, man. That was the how best great. thing about it. Yeah, I know. yeah, how great was that shit? Uh, that that the con play control in that game was pretty much flawless. Yeah. And like they did that whole hanging, that whole hanging from the fucking thing. Yeah, that was cool and I too. Was like, this is amazing. This is fucking great. All right, where's their standard? Is it over here somewhere? Or am I just come up here for no fucking reason? I think so. And it had great sound effects that? too. Yeah. Yeah, uh, even the sound effects were good. Yeah, even the sound effects in that game were fucking incredible. Oh, th this this guy again. Now we're not okay. fucking with this guy. Oh. Over here, Pete. Where are you? Down the stairs. Oh, yeah, we're going the wrong way. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not going to fight that guy again. Oh, we have to go up these stairs. Yeah, they were able to do. You know what? You know what's great about Castlevania is they're like able to, like, especially that game. Like, there's one level where it's kind of jazzy, you know, in the water area. Yeah. It's kind of like a little jazzy, and then like the next part could be like all foreboding and dangerous kind of sounding. Th that it just had so many ways to do it. I was just so amazed. Like, 
I remember when I first fucking played it, I was like, this is unbelievable. And, like, in the very first level where you can, like, go through the gate and shit, I was like, I can't believe you can go through this gate thing. You know what's even more impressive? That was an early release. I mean, that was, like, a... That, that was one of the earlier games on the system. Right. You know, that came out, like, what, 91? That was when the SNES was released, I think, at least in North America. Yeah. So, I mean, wow. And it just seemed like they kind of devolved after that game. Yeah, like, the uh, Bloodlines was uh, pretty much like a rondo of blood, but it was like a dumbed-down version of that. Mm -hmm. And I ended up playing Rondo of Blood, and that game is really good. But... It is no fucking ca uh, no Castlevania four. You know what I mean? I mean, uh, basically the two best games I guess you would have to say would be Castlevania four and then Symphony of the Night, maybe. I mean, yeah, overall, I would say I would I would say Castlevania three I'd also put on that list. That, okay, that's like a that's like a very close second or third. Yeah, yeah, I'd say close third. But fucking yeah, I, dude. Oh, let me tell you this story. All right, we were at only true. Get the hell away from me. Anyways, we were at only true gamers, uh, like the gaming thing, and one of the guys was playing Castlevania and he didn't know what to do. And I was I was kind of directing him on what to do, and it was like, uh, yeah, don't go over there. By the way, those bunch of those dudes. I think that was another boss dude. But anyways, he didn't know what to do, so I was kind of explaining him. I'm like, I can't believe. I can't believe someone doesn't know how to play this game. I was kind of sad. I felt a little old, but when, once he got the hang of it, he was kicking its ass. So I was like, ah, you know what? The young generation can still play. You know, whoever's doing that light-based attack, whenever you do it, I can use Blessed Shards and boost my shit. Uh, that would be Pete, I think. Yeah, that might be me. Alright, slay Agnor and take his that, helmet. Now where's... Yeah, you're actually... Oh, he's, he's in... in the, uh, he's in the dungeon. That bl Oh, now we gotta go back in there. That Blessed Shards thing that you're talking about there, James, that's a synergy. Some ultimates, when you... Oh, don't go... When you, uh, when you use them, if a, if a party member is nearby, you can activate a synergy, which has, like, a bonus effect. Oh, okay. That's what that is. Uh, there should be a synergy with my ultimate, too. I don't know if you guys ever see, like, something pop on your screen, like, press X or press a button to do this. When I got... Sometimes yeah, to I press uh, trigger the right trigger to exploit. Yeah, I see that. Oh, okay, so okay. My, my ultimate does have that. Okay, I was just wondering, because I couldn't remember. I thought, because mm. I thought mine, like, yeah, I thought mine was supposed to, like, heal you guys or something like that. Mm-hmm. Oh, man, I'm stuck in this fucking rut thing. How the hell did that happen? Uh, I'm stuck too, but th just go all the way to the top. You'll, you'll come out. Jeez. Yeah. Uh, I just got off my mountain, <laughs> jumped out of there. You know, I was, I was thinking about Nintendo lately, right? You know, they've had this huge success with Pokemon Go and whatnot. I mean, the, the, you know, you can't, you can't walk around the streets without seeing a couple people playing Pokemon Go. And I'm happy for Nintendo. Good for them. They got a ton of money. I kind of went, and then I saw this thing, this Nintendo, you know, they're coming out with this classic console. It's pretty much a glorified plug-and-play kind of thing. Yeah, I saw that shit. Yeah, I'm kind of interested in getting it, but I feel like I could just emulate it if I really want to do it. Like, I was I was thinking about getting it, and then I was thinking about it some more, like, why does Nintendo need my money? You know, maybe if they were a little more lenient to, towards, like, uh, people on YouTube, maybe I'd be like, okay... But now they're just being like, let's hand... Like, people are going to buy this little system hand over fist. What do you guys think? Well, I think that my brother-in-law is an idiot when I tell him that, hey, man, you can just play these games on your on your computer. But he, he's like, no, I, I want I want the system. You know, he's that kind of person. Like, you know... Yeah, he, but the thing is, that isn't, it, it won't be the system. It's just going to pretty much be an emulator. If you really think about it, that's like hopefully up-converting the shit so it looks... It looks all right, you know what I mean? Because it's a, it's pretty much a glorified plug-and-play in the essence that uh, it'll be HDMI and it'll just be an HDMI plug-and-play kind of thing. Yeah, if I if I do so, get one, it's gonna be for my brother-in-law. But although, yeah, right. I would never get one for myself. Fuck that. Yeah. yeah and the thing, ab and, and the thing about it is, a lot of people have been talking about like, uh, isn't the guy down here, Dan? 
I think so. I think he might be uh, on this side. Yeah, let's see. What's the safest Isn't that way? him over there? Uh, where? Down, down over there. Oh, I don't know. I'm jumping off this cliff. Alright, uh, yeah, I'm yeah. gonna look for the water. He's right over oh, here, here we go, here we go, here we go. Did we all, oh, shit, did we all jump off the cliff? I guess we're all jumping. Whee! I did not die, but... I will heal you once you get down. I am aiming... Ah, oh, missed. I aimed for the water, too, it didn't work. Alright, give me a second, let my magic get back. Oh, wait, this Agonar guy is the guy we killed last week for Dan, I remember now. Yes, yeah. we gotta kill him again. That's fine. But just give me a second while my magic uh, heals. But uh, the thing about it is, is like, I'm kind of, like I'm on the fence about it, but I'm like I don't know if I want to get it. And everybody's been talking about this thing. It's called a Raspberry Pi. All right, I'm just, I'm sorry, I just hit him. But everything uh, they're calling a ras it's called Raspberry Pi. It's pretty much like a motherboard or whatever. Where you can emulate like all these systems, PS1 and below, and so, and you can like literally play it. You can put H, it'll be in HD, so it has HDMI. It's got like four USB slots for controllers. Uh, what else do they have? Uh, I don't know. It looked it looked it's pretty awesome. The only problem is is it's like a it's like a thing where you have to like literally code everything yourself. Which I guess if you're not handy with that kind of thing, it, it can be a real problem. Like if you're not good with HTML or however you gotta code shit, it could be a real big problem, I guess. Uh, I'm not sure what... Do we have to take anything from him? Mount Agonar's helmet on a pike. Alright, nice. We're doing like a... Where, where's we're, the pike? We're doing a Ned Stark with uh, this guy's helmet. Nice. Did I take you have to nice reference? <laughs> <laughs> See, there we go. Now you're gonna get people who appreciate your references. All right, so where we uh, where do we uh, put his head his head on a spike? I think it's outside somewhere. Oh, okay, we gotta get out of here. But yeah, I, I just wish Nintendo was like, okay, we have enough money. Uh, we'll let people just do their YouTube thing and not bother you about it. Like I'd love to be able to talk to Steve and see how he what's going on with him with the with his uh, Twilight Princess LP if Nintendo's claiming him or if he because apparently oh, he's yeah. up, he's it, uh, it, he, he's having an issue with like everything. Yeah, I thought he was under that Nintendo thing where they'd be like, oh, we'll let you do whatever, only if apparently you play. Apparently, didn't uh, didn't help matters. Oh, that sucks. Is he talking to Curse about it? I, I told him to, but I, I'm not sure what what happened with that. Yeah. Where's their guys? Alright, there's some assholes over here. There we go. I think we got, yeah, we gotta head this way. But yeah, that's the problem with playing only Nintendo games. Although that's Steve's bread and butter, but, you know, Zelda's his thing, but... It sucks because I'd li like I think I was saying this weeks ago, but I I'd li I'd like to fucking go back and do like Zelda. Like we're supposed to like a when we um when we finished the first quest, me and Dan finished the first quest. We must have had a ton, a ton, a ton of people ask us, "Oh, could you do the second quest?" And we both said no in the video. But you know we'd be tempted to do it, but we're not ever gonna do it because Nintendo is just gonna s fucking flag us, which I think is stupid. Honestly, like, come on, how old is this fucking game? Like, 30 years old or something like that? 1987, I believe. Oh, yeah, so it's almost fucking 30 years old, and it's like, you're gonna flag a... No, actually, t I take that back, 1986. So it is 30. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so you're gonna fucking flag a content of a 30-year-old game? What kind of fucking money can you possibly be making off that shit? Like, man... It's not about it, it's about, you know, nickel and diamond people. Yeah, I know, that's why I'm, I'll never fucking do, you'll never see me play a fucking Nintendo game. Except Bait and Kaitos. I might do that if I can figure out to get the workaround around that. Because I know Nintendo now owns uh, whatever the thing that they their company was doing, so... But I'm going to I'm gonna attempt to do that, but it won't be for a while. Alright, so now where are we hanging his head up, Dan? Speaking of which, uh, 
What, what's going on with Konami? They still flagging people? Uh, I don't know. I haven't got I haven't gotten flagged about Konami in a while. Where are you, Dan? Oh, there you are. But yeah, I haven't been flagged by Konami in a while. I don't know if they're gonna even care anymore. I mean, they're going right to Pachinko, so they might not even bother with uh, dealing with anyone who puts footage up there. I'm surprised Vet kept his Xenoblade videos after h deleting his Zelda. Well, I don't. They didn't flag you on any of that, did they, nope. uh, Paul? Not once ever. Yeah. So he's good with that. I'm thinking maybe because Monolith Soft isn't Nintendo, they're just owned by Nintendo. Maybe. Yeah. I don't know. <clears throat> that could be the case. And Nintendo's maybe mainly only like interested in their like main IPs. Mm -hmm. Like Mario and Zelda and all that bullshit. Samus Metroid, and, and yep. Yeah, all that all that stuff. Yeah, Paul pretty much deleted his whole Wind Waker LP. Yep. Right? Gone. I deleted, kind I deleted of all my Zelda LPs. They're all gone. Every single one of them. Yeah. See, I still we still have our Zelda 1 and 2 LP up. Because uh, I think only one video out of the whole lot. I'm going to probably say this and then tomorrow they're all going to get flagged or whatever. But only one <laughs> LP out of the whole lot actually... Uh, Actually, or one video out of all, all those videos only got only one got flagged. So I was like, okay, I'll take I'll take my chances. Plus, I think that I think another thing too is, granted, I don't know, no, because they flag Steve stuff. Because I was gonna say maybe maybe they only look for like uh, so many you know views on a video, and they're like, oh, okay, we can we can get this guy, you know, kind of thing. Um, we gotta head south. Hello. Yeah, so that's what I'm thinking. The reason why they're 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 flagging them. Probably just, just total video. And and I and you know we've bitched about this before, but it really discourages people from playing their games or having anyone talk about their games. Like I'm sure this new Zelda is going to be pretty amazing, but I'm not going to get it. You know what I mean? Nope. Because it's like you've discouraged me as a fan so much where I'm like, I don't care. If I want to play Zelda with Skyrim, I'm sure you could probably get a, uh, a Zelda fucking uh, patch or something on the Skyrim game. Probably, yeah. I mean, there are there are <laughs> yeah. Zelda patches, yeah, or Zelda mods. Yeah, so you can fucking literally play as Link in Skyrim. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I've seen, I've seen cloud mods for Skyrim. Like play. Uh, uh, James, we're south. Follow the river down. Follow oh, the river down. Yeah, I've seen like you know Cloud Strife mod for Skyrim. O yeah, o so Orin mod that, for Skyrim. Yeah, so that's easily like done. You know what I mean? Yep. It's just, it's just, it's just like all right, I get it. No, and I'm, I'm very happy for them that they're finally like branching out a little bit and being like, okay, we're gonna, we're gonna have like this new way to play the game rather than I mean it's open world like the other games are sort of open world but not really in a way because it's like they can find you to these little areas in this giant world and now it looks like they're finally going yeah we're just gonna make this giant world and let you explore whatever the fuck you want yeah I'm waiting for that uh, Skyrim remaster to coming out in a few months yeah, I, I saw some videos of it. It looks fucking amazing. Yeah, and I, the Where cool is thing is for me, I get it for free because I got the original game and all the DLCs on PC. It sucks to be yeah. console people, man. They got to rebuy it if they if they want the remastered the version. Goat finished its work. The yeah. Goat honors the stone. Yep, another reason why console PC is better. Ooh. I mean, if you want to use yeah, consoles, thinking... fine, but... Um, you know, honestly, Paul, I was thinking about that today when I was fucking trying to get I Am Setsuna working on the ca capturing the footage. I was like, maybe I should have bought this for Steam. <laughs> <laughs> you should have. <laughs> I was thinking about it. I was like, oh, Christ, I should have bought this for fucking Steam. All right, let's see. What can we do next? Oh, yes. Let's go back to... Uh, uh, let us go back to... Let's find that way... Sh 
Way Shrine here, and we're gonna head back to that school. Remember that school of shit that we were trying? It was in a. We had to defeat all the arena dudes. Uh. Let's try. Yeah. Let's try that now that we have our buddy James with us. All right. Because before it was four people and we were getting our asses handed to us. Yeah, and I wasn't. Or three people. I, I, three. Well, you know, and to be honest, I wasn't really playing my best that day either. Yeah. Know? Well, it's all right. I wasn't using ultimates because I forgot that I even had them. I just. <laughs> Oh, this is just some dude with following us. But yeah, Let it good follow. Oh yeah, check your gear, good. fellas. How you doing on gear? Pretty good. Oh, actually, let me check mine here real quick. Okay, fifties and sixties for me. I'm gonna go back to the town and just repair my stuff really quick. All right, I'm there's gonna. A, uh... There's a way shrine right over here somewhere. Oh, there it is. Oh, man. I'm going to warp to... where the fuck is it? Where was this school thing? It was way up in the corner. Oh, okay, yeah. The trial of the arena. Apparently, I don't have a way shrine closer. The closest way shrine... to this, unless someone has a closer one. The closest one is... Seeker Archive way shrine. Wait a minute, which one are we going to? We're going to the. There's a school. All right. School. Okay. Here. Seekers Archive. I mean, a... yeah. The Trials of Rez... Razanaza. All right. I'm. I'm gonna go back here with uh, Dan. I'm gonna repair my gear real quick. Yeah. All right. The Razanaza School. That's where we're headed to. Okay. I. I still don't know where you're talking about, but I'll just follow your icons on the map and I'll figure it out. Mm-hmm. After I repair my stuff. I mean, shit. Why the yeah. hell am I going to waste repair kits when I don't have to? That's not You're not talking about the Dragon Star Arena? That, uh, weapons. That's, you can repair yeah, that, that okay. That makes sense. The Dragon Star Arena. There, there we go. Still, that's what, Yeah, them. isn't that where we're going? He, uh, he went somewhere else. He's in the middle of the map. No, we were doing this trial. We were doing this thing before. We had to... Defeat all the trials. Remember, we're walking oh, on the, air and the all that shit. Trial of martial knowledge. Yes. Oh, I know what you're talking about. I forgot all about that. I I have no uh, idea what you're talking about. <clears throat> I completely brain dumped whatever you're talking about. <laughs> yeah, this was like this was like two or three weeks ago when we uh when James wasn't around. We were farting around on here and we were um yeah we went and to we went to the trials and it was like one of them was. We did everything. There's but a then sky we, shard near here. We did everything, but then we got, we couldn't beat the last guy. There was like an arena where we were, they kept throwing enemies at us, and we were getting beaten up. Oh, Pete. Yeah. How the hell did you get way the hell over where you're at right now so fast? See where I am on the map? He teleported here. I'm just walking. Oh. Seekers Archive Way Shrine. Okay, well, it's actually faster if I just ride from where I'm at. It's about the same distance. Except there's a fucking mountain in my way, of course. Alright, guys. Fucking map. Fucking mountains. Shitty ass map, not telling me there's a mountain there. Oh, it looks like the sky shards in a delve. Yeah, we'll have to go there after. Yeah, Pete, I, I'm pretty sure you probably don't give a shit, but I have been recording pretty much this entire time. All right. Well, I'm. All, I also have a. I also have a stream. It'll be interesting to go back and watch your, your, uh, your uh, version of this. Oh yeah, absolutely, and then watch yours as well. Your yeah. point of view. See, see yeah. what was going on in that first boss battle that we did, you know, earlier. From your POV. Yeah. Fucking archers, I hate you assholes. I hate these bugs. Here we go, you fucking dead. Alright, let's keep heading south. You should probably start the uh, thing over so Paul, uh, so James can get the stuff that we did. Where are we going? Where are we going here? Oh yeah, all these gargoyles came to life. Oh yeah, I remember this. I'm running away. 
Hey Pete, wanna wait for us? <laughs> yeah, wait. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? Wait for you. You've I'm... got a bunch of scorpions following you. I'm almost at the door. The, the sweet, sweet release. But pa James, uh, James is not gonna be able to get in here, is he? I don't know. Oh, there's a dude I can talk to right Holy here. Holy dick! There's a lot of you assholes behind me. Wow. I got tigers fighting me. Pete, are you inside the thing? No, I'm not. It's like right on the outside, am... and now we got guys attacking us. Oh, yeah. oh there's the one lady, this one bald board broad is telling me to burn. How oh, nice. Oh, fuck. I'm not fucking with any scorpion. Er, God damn it. I mean, gargoyle. I'll fuck with a gargoyle. Stop throwing. There we go, we killed them. Alright, I'll wait right at the door for you fellas. I'm just gonna stand here at the sweet, sweet door. You guys, I just ran past all those assholes. Cause I was like, I'm getting attacked. And then I had like 15 guys hitting me here, and I don't know how I survived, but I did it. Woo! Otherwise, do I actually have to go in these areas? What is this? Oh, the way of the blade. Let's look at this bullshit. Nah, I don't care. Ah, the way of the blade. Oh, you guys fighting those gargoyles? Yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, you want me to come down and help you? That would help. All right, I got you. Whee! Where are you? Oh, James. I was trying to heal you. I don't. I don't have enough for an ultimate yet. Where is James? Hey, wait. He... He is... Pete, you were supposed to hold your partner's hand. <laughs> what are you talking about? I was way over here before you guys got here. No, I'm just making a buddy system joke. Oh, well, yeah, I get, I get it, Dan. I get should it. we help James, or should we just hang around here? Like retards. Uh, James, what do you have to do? Apparently, what I've got to light these damn... Oh, fuck. Fucking gargoyle. Where are you? Yeah, we we, we'll got, we you gotta out. help James. He's right over here. Alright, where is this James? Do, 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 do. Oh yeah, lighten these fucking fire things while all these gargoyles come after us. Oops. Hmm. Hmm. Ah. Fucking. Oh, yeah. Yeah. James, if you can get up to where we are, and then we'll help you get back down. Okay. Okay. So, yeah. Oh, oh, you guys aren't far. Yeah. Okay. Once we're okay. done killing these gargoyle pricks, we'll come and help you out. All right, we got rid of them. Good, good, good. All right, where you have to light a fire over there? Yeah, I have to. I have to go over to this door. Do something over here with All right, yeah, this gargoyle. Yeah. Oh. Blessed shards. There we go. Alright, what's next? Oh yeah, you gotta do this thing. Oh yeah. This fucking guiding flame. So like Alright, I remember this Fuck. shit now. Took yeah, see, see, and then we went. And the last one is right here. Just as a crucible burns this fucking a lady. So the trial of fire She's like, oh. To enter I'm a ghost and I'm Last still not fucking a pee piece. Alright, so. Yeah, you get. Now we oh, gotta, I gotta uh, light the damn brassiers now. Yeah, the brassiers. <laughs> gotta light them bras up. The women's Burn the. 
burn those bras just like they did in the 70s. Or maybe it was the 60s. It could have been late 60s, early 70s. I don't remember. I carry the yes, let's flesh. burn undergarments no, that blazer, keep our tits so up. Like the way. Yeah. That never All made right. any sense hey. to me. Hey, they can do what they want. Like take we want our tits to sag when we're old. I get, is that, was that their mentality uh, when they when they burn their bras? Man, uh, I, don't get it. I think they just wanted. I think they just wanted equal rights. Maybe I don't know. I, I think we I think we should burn our cup or cups in like solidarity. You know, get a bunch of cups and be like, we'll burn these for you, ladies. We'll help you out. Just like you have tits, we have balls. All right, so and we will we will ball it up or whatever. I don't know. Christ, so the shut the fuck up! Well, I thought I was joking when it's. I'm telling you, James. I was saying these, these these boss these fucking ghosts are so bossy. You know what I mean? They sure are. All right, they're let's... like. They're like, uh, light, just as the light does da 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 da. It's like, yeah, I get it. Fire. Get on with it. I can't right, the Spirit of the plane. Warrior. Take me to the brazier so I may light the way. Take me to the da 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 so I can light the way. Shut your stupid hole. <laughs> God, you know, I was, you know what I was watching yesterday? Super Troopers. Oh God! I fucking love that movie. God, I love Would that. Would you like movie. to know more? Right, meow. <laughs> oh wait, no. I, I, I'm mixing. I'm mixing up Super Troopers with uh, what's with fucking Starship Troopers. Yeah, yeah, dude. I watched Starship Troopers too. I, I never saw that. Um, is that the one with uh, with uh, Alan Rickman and he's like uh, by whatever's wrath. You will be avenged, or am I thinking of something different? Uh, Starship Troopers is the one with that that fucking goofy ass movie with Denise Richards and, Just and oh no 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 Harris and so the trial of fire they're fucking fighting bugs or whatever. And they, oh yeah yeah yeah. The last is Would you like to know All more? Right, so yeah. Okay, so I gotta defeat the champion up. Wait, which okay, way is yeah. it? He's over here. He has three gargoyle buddies. He's gonna. All right. So should me and Dan just kind of flank them, then? Uh, yeah. If you want to move to the sides, and then I'll throw over the first thing. Because right. these gargoyles are coming to life. Sure. So. All right. Let me know when you guys are in position. Uh, I'm ready. How close am I caught up to you guys? Uh, 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 we. After this, we gotta go inside and do some shit. Ready? Nope. Yeah. Through it. Yeah, see, he's a red guard just like you, uh, James. Yeah, for some reason, he's chasing me. I'm not sure why. Yeah. Uh, if I can get up, I can use my ultimate and heal you. There we go. Thanks, Pete. No problem. Gargoyles hey, are he's... coming down. Here come the gargoyles. Come on, get up. Get up. James, hold up. Let me heal you. Damn uh, it. Shit, sorry. Oh, this Sorry. is the guy. Oh, oh yeah, shit. I remember this guy. He, uh, yeah, you gotta back the fuck up off of him. Yeah, I just got fucking... Shit. Here, let me you guys go ahead and... I just got... Oh, shit. Yeah, these three you guys, guys are gangbanging me, man. Uh, god damn Did we it. get him? Alright, we got him. Right, the gargoyles are, uh... Here, let's, let's... Oh, I died. Too many. All right, I'm back. Too many. Holy shit. Four gargoyles. Oh, you know what? I'm not using my crowd control bullshit. I'm dead. Come on. James, stay alive if you can. Shit. That's all right. It's all right. We got... This isn't a dungeon, so we can... We can still get these fuckers. Yeah, we almost got this guy. Here we go. One down, three to go. Or is that it? That's it. That's it. I thought you gargoyles ran away. Yeah, the two of, Let's uh, search two of, the of body over of the here. Cham Let's search the body of the champion. Where is he? This guy's not the champion. He's over here. He's over here, Pete. 
You guys are not the champions. He's right over where I am. Nah, it's too late. I gotta kill these guys. But yeah, Super Troopers is the one with Farva. Yeah. And they do car ramrod. And, <laughs> and then, uh... Car ramrod? Brian Cox. Yeah, and Brian Cox is like, next guy who says shenanigans, I'm gonna pistol yeah, whip. I'm... Oh, Farva, what, what's the name of that wacky restaurant? You mean shenanigans? Where they got all that stuff. Yeah, you mean shenanigans? <laughs> Are you guys talking about shenanigans? <laughs> oh, that fucking movie's so good. Yeah. You mean shenanigans? And then when they were doing the meow thing? <laughs> yeah. Yes. Fuck great? Meow. Meow. <laughs> right meow. Yeah. Is something funny to you? Meow. <laughs> yeah. He's like, license and registration meow. <laughs> and then Jim Gaffigan's laughing. He's like, are you saying meow? Is something funny meow? <laughs> you know? <laughs> Am I drinking milk from a saucer? <laughs> you see me eating mice. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a good movie. You know, classic. Yeah. Funny funny thing about that is uh, that guy Farva, he's actually from West Haven where we live, Dan. Huh. Yeah. And his mom used to be the uh, one of the secretaries over at uh, over at uh, my dentist. And when he uh, and when he uh, what was it? What happened? When he uh, got big and all that, he they left, obviously, as you would. <laughs> the test of the small town. Yeah. I'm leaving. It's not all of you. Uh, yeah. Well, I mean, he became pretty big, so I. I totally get it. Why he would leave. So that's where we got beaten up, Paul, remember? Yeah, but we have to do all these stupid trials all over again. Why do we have to do all that's this shit fault. all over again? Because of so me. So James can catch up on oh. Well, I'm no, sorry. but no, I, it, I mean, it's telling me that I need to do all this bullshit over again. Like, I mean, I know we gotta do them all over again oh. for James, but on my map, it's telling me that I gotta do them all over again. Like, I never yeah. did them like three oh. weeks ago. Yeah, it's stupid. Yeah, it is stupid. Who the hell is... Damn archers. Yeah, let's see if we can do this. I mean, do we have enough time to get through the rest of this place? I don't know, man. That's why I'm like, I'm a. We're gonna try and do this like uh, quickly if possible, but yeah, I don't know. This might have to be next week's objective. But the only problem about it is like, if we do it, ne you know, we'll have to do all this shit all over again. Yeah. So why are we even doing this right hey. now? Eh, let's just kill a couple more guys. All right. All right is everybody getting all right experience from this stuff? Yeah. Yeah, I'm getting pretty decent. I'm getting pretty good experience, so. And there's a lot of them, so I'm all right with killing I mean, all these guys. It's better assholes. than like in the olden days where I got none. Yeah. Plus, I'm gaining a lot of really nice gold. Like, like thirty gold from each dude and shit. Here's where you get the sands right. that you throw across the. Uh... Oh right, right, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember that. Yeah, we gotta get that. But you know what, well, James, lead us to where I think I sort of remember where the sky shard is. If we want to grab that form, and then we could be done with this area. At least for now, yeah. Yeah. Oh, shit, tigers. And this will be our objective next week, definitely. Ooh. Oh, I fucking died! Wow. You know what it is? All those fucking archer bastards. Well, Pete, they were kind of like forming a crescent on a hill, and you kind of ran in the middle of them. So they were kind Dan, of. Dan, I think they attacking you from all sides. Uh, Dan. What? Uh, I think I uh, know what I'm doing. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Uh, use the sands, Dan. Do you still have them? Yep. Yeah. Nice. Only the ah, pendant what man. What the will hell is shooting at? Some. Fucking jerk off is shooting at us. I, it's alright, I got him. Jeez. Alright, thank you. 
Only the penitent man will pass. I think this guy so shot this. Kneels before God. Yeah. Kneels. Jehovah begins with an I. Okay, here we go. Oh yeah, we gotta hug. We gotta hug the. We gotta hug the coast here. Did you ever see that interview where he was talking with Barbara Walters about about uh, slapping a bitch? Uh oh. Yeah, oh, that, I think I saw that. That was some funny stuff. If they mouth off, you gotta you gotta you gotta smack a hoe. Where's the thing? Oh, it's over here. It's over this way. So Dan Marshmallow was uh, was asking where you've been lately. Yeah. Yeah. She's like, where is that long-haired fella? Why did he change his address? Yeah. What the hell? Yeah, you're gonna have to give me that so I can send you a, a Christmas card. Okay. Uh, James, is there a sky shard around here? I'm not seeing a sky shard on my map. There's not one in the south here. Just a little further somewhere. Somewhere. I thought Let there was a sky shirt over here. Yeah, it's, it's not appearing on my map. Hmm. Yeah, and since I've already gotten it, it's not, it's not showing up on my map. But I thought there was one in here. I thought so too, but <laughs> maybe not. Hmm. I mean, you got the sky maybe. shards uh, add-on initiated there, James, or? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know that. Oh, is this what we're doing? Yeah, we're just coming down here. Yeah. It's like the cool thing to do now. <laughs> well, we are the cliff divers. Yeah. Here's another. Here's another here's book. Another book that we don't care about. Oh yeah, that's that's yeah, why we not... did that last week to get that fucking book. Right, right, yeah. right. So there was a purpose to doing that. Yeah, you stole all your shit. All right, fellas, I think that's it. I think we're going to wrap it up. I'm going to walk the hell out of here. But yeah, that champion arena, man, oh man. That was fucking tough. But we should be able to do it this time. Oh yeah, we got the fourth person and then... Is that... Is that down over here? Yeah. Uh, okay. Actually, what? Yeah, we. That, so we'll that's be doing the, that next week then. Yeah, that's the last thing I think you need to do because you pretty much have to walk on air and look at all the books. You gotta beat. You gotta do that thing outside where you already did it with the flames, and then there's a bunch of other little shit that we gotta do in there. Collect all the books and be like, oh, now you can read. Congratulations! And it's like, all right, I get it. Oh, I should be able to breeze through most of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The the only hard part would probably be the. Uh, the uh, uh, what the hell is it? The arena thing. All right. Apparently, I don't have an area where I could just warp bow, warp back to. So I'm just gonna fucking use some money and warp back to the town. I don't think any of us do, man. I know. Is there's no uh, local way shrine near here? It doesn't look. I mean, there's Very one to the fucking the closest ones to the northwest, but it's far away. So fuck that. Yeah. Yeah. All right. I'm going to lose my shirt here. That's what some lady just said. I'm going to lose my shirt here. On the stream? <laughs> no, one, one of the characters in the game oh. is just randomly talking. I was going to say, if somebody's talking like that on the stream, you're like, whoa, whoa, lady. Yeah, I like, I like to find out who you are. <laughs> 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 if you're losing your shirt. But, uh... Yeah, once again, uh, thank you fellas for joining the stream. Let me plug Only True Gamers before we head out. Only True Gamers has finally got their own website at OnlyTrueGamers.net. Go there, check it out. You can sign up on the Facebook page right from the website.